What's going on YouTube? Embo's back with another gameplay. Um, this gameplay is versus TK. I was playing with Obey. Uh, we actually 4 one them, I believe, in this gameplay, but I do really good. Um, recently, uh, this is the team I've been playing with, you know, uh, we actually wound up beating TKO in this series, and, uh, we actually beat Envy, too. Um, I mean, it was a good day for scrims-wise, but also I'm going to be doing the 4 4 today, just letting you guys know, so go check out next year's stream. But, yeah, guys, you know, I actually, I, I know, like, there's really nothing to play for, but it's always in that back of your mind, like, you just want a team, like, you just want to have someone to play with, like, you never know, it could roll over into a different game, you never know what could come up next, so, so I'm just gonna, you know, hopefully, I do good to, uh, today, or whatever, if we play, and, uh, I'll be able to play with Obey, you never know, anything could happen, but, um, I'm pretty sure they're running with other people, um, what else is going on, uh, oh yeah, my S and D team, right now, it's me, Next, Creator, and Crump, uh, we're actually gonna do a 44 today with Umper, I believe. Uh, yeah, I think so. But, uh, TKO, I actually think they're gonna, like, I'm not just saying this because, oh, I have a few friends on the team or they're just, you know, really good players, but I honestly think they can go and definitely win. Like, it's, these guys' slaying power is it's, it's incredible. Like, honestly, like, the slay, if you have a slay on your team, he mu he has to do good at all times to beat them. Or your subs have to just go off because if they don't, it's just going to be too hard to beat them. You know, like, I'm pretty confident in them winning it. And I'm pretty sure they're confident in themselves, obviously. And Envy, they're definitely, they have a chance of winning it too. Like, you can't knock anyone because you never know. Even the EU team could win it. Because um, Envy, uh, I don't think they, yeah, they never been to EGL, I don't think. But, you know, they're not accustomed to how some EU players play or... Uh, not saying that it's any different, but I'm just saying in general, you never know. They might have their own little tricks and shit. But, I, and neither is, T I know TKO scrimmed a few EU teams, but you can't knock them. You can't knock the EU teams, because they can just show up and win. Because, you know, they're more accustomed. But, also, Optic, you know, they're another big contender, obviously. They won the past two. Um, everything's looking good for them as well. I mean, they, but the weird thing is, they always lose online. But when it comes down to land... They perform <laughs> like that's the creepy thing about it and that's what actually what matters it, that's what it all comes down to so you can't they can't really complain nobody can really complain I mean they show up and win then what can you say um this weekend NJ Halo you know I'm playing with me Spacely be out fire methods um hopefully we go there win that I mean it's not really something to scrim, scrim for but I mean, I would like to be prepared for it. I just want to go win that, man. Because that would just be another, you know, earnings or whatever. And it's always good to win for the last MW3 land, really. Um, and me and PC are also going to be doing the 2v2s. Uh, they, I'm not sure if it's going to be live streamed. I hope it is. Because, you know, it's going to be a fun. It's always fun. NJ Hill is always fun. But the part that sucks about it is the waiting. Like, oh, God, it's, it's just so annoying, but it, it's a local, so, you know, everyone there, I mean, it's not that hard waiting, or it's not that boring, but sometimes, you know, you run out of shit to do. I mean, it's always good to see everyone you chill with online, talk to online, and chill with them in person. Uh, when I go there, I hope to meet people that watch my videos, maybe, um, new people that I never met before, just, if you see me, just come up to me, uh, if you're not, if you're not sure who I am. I'll probably like wear a jersey or something that I have. Um, what else? What else? What else? Cause I just free. I just free my commentaries. Like I don't pre-plan them or whatever. I record a game plan. I just talk. So like if I'm like what if I'm not sure what I'm gonna say next, I apologize. But I just feel like it's always better to do this and just be more be more like yourself instead of just be like writing. Oh, I'm gonna talk about this. I'm gonna talk about this. I'm gonna talk about this. I mean. I don't, I don't care, man. Like, it's whatever. Some people like my videos, some people don't. And what can you say? There's always going to be people that don't like what you do. Just got to live with it. But this, I'm like literally on this map, I suck. Online, I suck at it. I just thought I'm going to do good. Because when we, when me, Spacely, John, and Saint scrimmed for Godzilla, this map, I literally went 0 and 6, 0 and 7 every time. It was so annoying. But when we showed up to land, I dropped an 11 bomb on it. It's just weird, like, how, uh, land could just change things. Like, you see a team online, they suck, go on land, they, they run people, and it's, it's eye-opening. 
to see how much land can change a player, a team, etc. So, that's really what I have to say, guys. I, I mean, I hope more people, like, go toward to land and m play more for land instead of just, like, sticking out online because land is where it's at. Bullets actually fucking register and kill people. And that's what I'm saying. Like, I was using the PP90, and, and if you guys watch my videos, you know I drop shot a lot. And <clears throat> online, I drop shot. I can literally fall to the ground and get back up, and the guy still won't be dead. On land, I drop shot him halfway and not even hitting the ground, and he's dead already. Like, that's the upside of it. Your bullets actually connect and anything is possible. Like, there's people that online that have got some god ass connections. You get on land, and you're, you're so quick to kill him. It's like right there and i'm gonna let this last round speak for itself guys thanks for watching my video please like subscribe love you all and peace